the moment of truth. Hello everybody, welcome and welcome back to my channel. If you're new, my name is Jenica and this channel is everything about clean beauty, non-toxic living and wellness for a smooth transition into a clean lifestyle. Alright, so today I'm back with another hair video. So I'm actually washing my hair. I'm not going to show you the clips but I, because I already have a video about it. So I'll put the link over here so you can click on it. Um, as I told you guys in that video, I don't use regular shampoo or... Well, I try not to because... The shampoo that I'm using is actually a clay shampoo and makes my hair so soft and I love it so I'm just gonna stick to it. I will alternate of course sometimes but so far so good. So the video today is about a product that I saw on TikTok and no I haven't posted on TikTok yet. I created my account as I told you in my pre previous video but I haven't uploaded anything but yeah TikTok is actually an outlet for me right now where I just like relax and I look at um, things to do, tips, anyways, I don't know, it's so entertaining, uh, but yeah, I will post one of these days, one of those days, one day in the future, I don't know, because I know some people are waiting for my TikTok videos, although I don't know what I'm gonna do, <laughs> but anyways, so, um, I actually saw this product on TikTok, and yesterday, I placed my order through Amazon, and it came today. So I was like, you know what? I need to wash my hair, so I need to test the product along with you guys so you will see if it works or not. I haven't watched any reviews about it. Um, I just went on, uh, I saw the girl who posted it on TikTok, and I was like, okay, let me see if we have it here in Canada. So I went on Amazon Canada, I made the purchase, and I looked at the reviews. They had quite good reviews, so I said, okay, I'll... I'll give it a try. So here is the product. So it's the Revlon One Step English. <laughs> uh, Revlon Salon One Step Hair Dryer and Styler. So all my natural girls, you know that. And anyways, me having four C C C C C or four Z, as I love to say. <laughs> so or after I'm done washing my hair, I just don't feel well. No offense, that for that, no people in the natural hair community they're gonna come for me. No, like I mean, it's fine. Um, so when I'm done washing my hair, for the most part, I don't like combing my hair. I just let it air dry, which is very bad sometimes. And then after it's super dry. Anyways, any, every time I have to blow dry my hair, I get so tired, so lazy. So I was like, you know what? I'll give it a try. I'll buy this. So, okay. So I decided to buy this one because I had like a, how do you call it? Like just a regular hand dryer with the attachment. But honestly, it's so uncomfortable for me to have the attachment. And then with the comb, I will start like in the back and then I'll be so discouraged. I'll be like, you know what? I'm done. And then I will just like go like this and it's just a mess so I figured and I'm hoping that this will make my life so much more easier okay I'm very excited to try it actually um, let me unbox it with you I haven't opened it I received the package still sealed and everything so let's open it together so here it is there's nothing else in the box it's just this I'll link it below hopefully it's good this is really a first impression, okay? And oh well, I'll just rip it. If I don't like it, I'll return it. I hope there's a warranty. 48 months. Okay. Okay, this is what it looks like. It's very light. I'm surprised. It's really light. Um this seems to be very, very steady and hard. I'm like exaggerating so you guys can see, right? And then you have the holes over here. That's where the heat will come out. You have three settings. Oh, I'm already seeing something dead. What I see that is missing is actually the button. You know when you're blow drying your hair and you don't want the heat to be too hot? 
so to make it cooler I don't see that I don't know maybe I should read maybe I should anyways I don't see it so I'm gonna go ahead and wash my hair okay okay guys so I'm back my hair is washed so oops I'm gonna go ahead and plug this in let me turn it on Ooh. okay so you have the three settings here I'm actually very excited to try it out so let's give it a try How many of you use a live-in conditioner? Let me know in the comments. I'll link the heat protectant that I'm using below. Everything was from Amazon. So, the moment of truth. Make sure my hands are dry. So I'll start with the cool setting. So right now I'm on the low setting. It's actually not bad. This is the high. It's really not bad. Um, of course, I prefer the low setting because the height is a little bit too hot, and this is the hair. Just some hair in the brush. As you can see, nothing too dramatic. But yeah, let's go. And I will say that yes, you need a heat protectant um, when you blow dry your hair. You want to make sure you have one to avoid any damage or heat damage. So I strongly suggest it.
so now I'm just going ahead and I'm continuing blow drying my hair um, it's actually very fast guys like it's faster than I expected I was very surprised with the results I must say So then I had a helper to help me out with my hair. I didn't ask for help, but she actually wanted to try it out. So yeah, I'm really grateful for that. <laughs> um, I was not complaining. I mean, all of it was easy, but as we were both drying the hair, we realized that we're supposed to hold the blow dryer up and not how we're doing it right now. So you'll see in the next clip how we, we switch the positions and blow drying from an uh, upwards position direction if I can say it like that. So after doing the right side we decided to come back to the left side because we figured out how the blow dryer was working so we have to go from an upwards position as I said. And now we're just going ahead and applying the cool setting to the entire back section of my hair. So this is all cool setting. And here I'm showing you the entire hair that I lost from the back section. It's not a lot. And yeah, I'm really happy about it. So now I'm just saying bye to my helper because she was not about to help me for my entire head. So yeah, but I'm so grateful. <laughs> By the way, am I the only one who needs to have bomb music while washing her hair? <laughs> All right, everybody. So this is the final result. Um, honestly, it was really quick. I was expecting it to be longer, but because usually when I do blow dry my hair, it takes forever. So um, yeah, it was really fast. I got help to do like the back of my hair because my helper wanted to try out um to test out actually the blow dryer as well but on my hair so um yeah this is my hair i sure i surely i definitely need a trim i guess it will be easier for me to see like where to trim etc so my review on the blow dryer one salon one step salon Honestly, it gives you the salon effect, not effect, but you know, like just a blowout. Um, if you don't want to go to the salon, and sometimes it just salons for natural hair, or just like the prices are outrageous. But anyways, I didn't lose a lot of hair. Um, and what I should tell you about this hair dryer, I okay, the heat comes out only from the top the top hold so basically I don't know if you could see but as I was doing it I had to well at first when I started I was doing it like this like in the back of my hair but clearly I didn't realize that the heat was not um, throughout the entire comb so it goes out only from the top so after that when my helper came um, that's how uh, we figured it out so that's why um, we're going this way I'm doing it like this so the heat like actually straightens your hair so but other than that um if i would have to to rate this well i'm gonna rate it not if i would have i will rate it and i'll give it out of 10 i will give it maybe 7.5 no i would say eight eight the only reason why um okay it's very lightweight okay um, honestly it doesn't really bother me that the the top holds only um the air only comes out of the top holes I feel like it may protect your hair better because imagine if the hair would the air would come out the entire holes I think it would be more damaging for the hair so I don't really mind this um, my only thing is that it gets really really hot I don't know if you could see the 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 smoke as I was blow drying my hair. 
it gets really hot and i feel like the more you use it it gets harder hotter i don't know if it's in my head or maybe my hair well when i came to that part most of my hair was already dry so a little bit of heat was already too much that could be it though that could be it um yeah but other than that i really like it um it's easy to use um now i can have a blowout like easily i can do a ponytail Ugh, easily guys usually i would have to do like two ponytails and then i have a ponytail i didn't need it to be too too straight because i mean this is my hair's texture i don't really mind it but yeah i just need a trim right now yeah uh, okay yeah the only reason also i gave it well yeah basically i didn't i didn't complete my sentence the reason why i would give it uh, eight is because there's not like you know the cool sex the, the cool setting as I say you put it on high You still want it high, but not too hot and then you have to press the button and then it gives you cool air Um, you don't have that so that's um, something that is missing Um, accord well In my opinion you do have the cool um, I guess it comes out to the same you have the cool uh, setting here. It's also uh, Very strong. Let me turn it on So this was the high and then when you put it on cool okay so it's basically equivalent so but the low I'll put the low so you can see the difference yeah the low is hot but it doesn't blow um, the air as strong as before as the other one yes guys so let me know what you think honestly Okay, since the setting is almost the same, okay, I'll probably bring it up a notch and give it 8.5 just because it gets really hot. That's the only reason why. And in terms of the technology, I don't know how much, like in terms of radiation, I didn't go like too deep into it because radiation can be bad, etc. I didn't really look into it. I'm gonna be frank and honest with you. I didn't look it up. I was just looking for a blow dryer that was gonna do the job and blow out my hair and I think I got it guys. So right now I don't know what I'm gonna do to sleep. I'm, I'm probably, um, oh by the way I moisturized my hair with the Mile Organic the Avocado. So this is my favorite moisturizer. It's my favorite one. Like the smell is it's not too strong if I compare it to um, the Palm Grenade collection. This is way too strong for me, but I already had it, so I wanted to finish it. I, I also had the shampoo, and at, at some point, the shampoo would give me a headache. That's how strong it is to me. So I have the the um, hair live-in conditioner. So I applied this, followed by <clears throat> uh, the heat protectant, and then after I applied the moisturizer so this is it guys let me know what you think i'm pretty sure honestly um revlon did a good job it's my first time buying one of these products and i think it'll be such a relief for people around me because i would always ask someone to blow dry my hair and yeah nobody really wanted to because yeah i guess i have a lot of hair not to say a big head, but whatever. <laughs> so, yeah. So, this is it, guys. I hope you enjoyed this video. Make sure to follow me and subscribe to my channel. Follow me also on Instagram. I'm not on TikTok. Well, I'm on TikTok, but nothing is posted yet. So, give this video a thumbs up. Okay, let me know. Other, if you have any other suggestions, let me know. And if you're not subscribed, make sure to click that subscribe button and follow the journey so i'll see you guys in my other video so take care bye